Presented by Midas Auto Service and Tires. We're always a touch better. A standout sprinter at Springfield is now on four NLL crowns year after year after year <laughs> after year. Will it be enough to make our top five plays of the week? Find out right after this at number five. Speaking of the NLL, softball. Anthony Wayne's Molly Connor, the big hit in the big game as the Generals, the extra inning victory over Springfield one week ago. Connor grooves this to right. That's going to drop. Two runs will come in to score. At number four from fifth third field, Chase Young with the backhand stab throws out the runner from the seat of his pants. Devin Sweet trying to finish him off. Ground ball to second deep. Backhanded diving stop from a sitting position. He throws to first and they got him. Wow, there is a, uh, a play for the highlight reel. Here's some more plays from the highlight reel. You're right, Carly. Mara Scott, three wins of the 100, the 200, and the 400 of the NL Championship, something she has done all four years of her outstanding high school career. Bottles in lane six will be a factor in this as well with a preliminary time at 12.72. And here comes Mara Scott. Bottles behind her. The race is on for second, but it's all Mara Scott. At number two, check out this diving grab from Anthony Wayne's Tommy Keck. What a heck of a catch from Keck. Number one, Country Roads take us home. Riley Sawchuk sending the fish into the Western Conference Finals with the overtime game winner against Wheeling on Saturday. Sawchuck, the shot, he scores! Riley Sawchuck wins it in overtime, and Toledo is off to the Western Conference Finals. Top 5 Plays of the Week is brought to you by Midas. They'll tell you what needs fixing now and what can wait. Trust the Midas Touch.